State. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of very pleasant Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and we've got a sea of green out there. All the U.S. indices we track, all the sectors inside the S&P 500 are trading to the upside. Dow's up 562 points, about 1.5%. 1 and 9 tenths for the S&P are 96 points, 2 and 4 tenths for the NASDAQ 100. 430 points there, 2% nearly for the Russell, 38 points, nearly 5% for the semis. That's a 212-point move. Whoa, that is a bullish move out there. But we've got to take a look at the charts to see what it really means out there. Trend is up 226, 1.5%. Gold's up 20 bucks. Silver, 46 pennies. Lights recruit up 76 cents. Natural gas is flat, <clears throat> down 1 cents. 30 treasure off a half a point. Print out 121.30. Let's try to figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel market update chart. We'll begin with the ES Mini. No new profile did form yesterday, although there's a new one that's attempting to form again today. This one, and this just appeared because when I looked at this chart two minutes ago, it wasn't there. Uh, this one uh, shows, uh, and this is a bearish signal if this profile takes hold at day's end um, because, it's, uh, tr because it's above price. Now, the issue is I'm looking at my other screen and I've got a different set of profiles. So we'll take a look at all of them today. I think it's the white screens charts that are going to be more accurate. Let's take a look at spot volatility. It's trading above its 50-day exponential moving average. Uh, that is uh, puts the, gives sellers the advantage out there. So if there's going to be some kind of rug pull, um, you know, you got to be careful. This could it could be a quick move to the downside inside the S&P 500. The NQ, right now, it's got a, a bullish engulfing candle. That would confirm a buy the D point. But now this also shows a new profile above price and the white charts within price. So again, we'll take a look at both. U.S. dollar index is uh, just consolidated with inside its daily profile. That's between the range of 102 and a quarter to 103.26. You got gold that is consolidated with inside its bullish structured profile, uh, support at 2417, resistance 2537. The number to watch here for Goldilocks is 246310 to be exact. Why? Because that's its perigee pivot point. If we see a close above that, we get back up and we retest uh, at least the uh, prior swing point at 2504, maybe all the way up to the 2537 level. Silver would uh, conform, would form a, a Gartley buy pattern today. You've got a bullish engulfing candle going on there. New profile that's also attempting to form. Support at 2679, resistance 2935. Lights recruit is consolidation with inside its profile between 7239 and 7816. Natural gas consolidating, trying to take on resistance at the 212 level. And a 30 year treasury now inside its profile with a sell the D point pattern. Odds favor move to 11907 to 12002. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Ed Show. But if you have to start your Thursday, have a terrific one, and we'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now.